The following is a selected video from yourteacher.com where you can browse over 450 complete math lessons with example videos, interactive practice problems, self-tests, and more. Try a complete lesson today at yourteacher.com. To solve for x in this equation, notice that x appears in two different terms, and in one of those terms, x is squared. So clearly this is a different situation than we're used to seeing. This type of equation is called a polynomial equation. And in order to solve for x, we would first factor the left side. Notice that the left side of the equation is a trinomial in a special form that can be factored as the product of two binomials. As our first term for each binomial, we have the factors of x squared, x times x. And as our second term for each binomial, we have the factors of negative 28 that add to negative 12, which are negative 14 and positive 2. And remember, it's all set equal to 0. Now we have a situation that's just like our first example we have two binomials that are multiplying together to equal zero. So either x minus 14 equals zero or x plus 2 equals zero. Solving for x in each equation, add 14 to both sides on the left and x equals 14 Subtract 2 from both sides on the right. x equals negative 2. So x equals 14 or x equals negative 2. And we write our answer as the solution set 14, negative 2. Like any equation, you can go back and check your answer in the original problem and you'll see that both solutions work. 